we go. Hello, everybody. Right, I made a, a decision after I stopped filming yesterday. It was far too chunky, so I've taken some pages out, so you might see things shuffled around. Um, I didn't undo it. I literally tore them out, but I folded them up, and they're in, you know, like here, places like that. Um, uh, yeah, I took that one out as well because it was I want to decorate it a little bit more and it was getting too big and I felt as though I know my sister wouldn't like it if it was too big so I'd done that oh and I one of the pages that I took out actually had that on that I'd done yesterday so I took it out and I stitched it on the back there which has worked fine okay and I don't know whether I showed that but I just used some odd things around you know that Janet give me and just put them there and I've just got to make a little tag to go in here so that's what I've done with that page instead of it being where it was <laughs> it happens sometimes I just felt it was, it was you know and I took a couple of these orange pages out here I took that one out of this one so there's actually now eight pages in each signature and I still got some decorating to do because I want some lace hanging some black more black lace hanging over there because if you look that bit of black lace there is just standing out a little bit more than the rest and I when I when that happens I will put some black lace longer on these bits to come up to meet that so it all looks pretty level really just the way I stitched it in I can't take that one out because I stitched it in it's always the ones that I stitch in but anyway that is Fine. and we got because I want I've got things to make for here which I want to do and I want to put some more of her stuff in and it was just getting too big and she gave me this so I've put that in there because I thought that looks okay and then we'll decorate this down here yeah so that's why I've done that I don't know whether I showed that I just put that on the grommet on top there so it's just and then tied it because the grommet is actually too big for that hole there so I just tied it on but it still looks like it's a grommet on there yeah I think um, you saw that one I done yeah that I'm far happier now it's you know I know we're gonna put stuff in but I just thought no that's loads better now I want to decorate some more tags that we've already done and envelopes and things like that to go in here so that's what I've done Oh, and I also found this at the back of my bag that she gave me. Some few bits there that we can use, I think. That's nice. Can use some of that. And I also got my Dymo out to create some words. Because I haven't got any Halloween stamps. Not here. I might have up in the attic. But So I thought, oh, I'll do them on this. So I've done Poison, Wicked, and Scary at the moment. <laughs> quite original I've <laughs> uh, got poison there I'm going to cut that poison out actually that was, that's a nice stamp I think she stamped that I didn't see that one I would have liked that that would have been handy never mind right so we've got to change this envelope haven't we uh, I've already done a little bit of paper I just this is something I cut off one of the pages so that we could fit it in somewhere so I thought I could put that over there. Like that. To cover that over. So we're not going for tranquility. <laughs> okay. Let's see what word we got then. Yeah, I've done these a while ago. That's... I totally forgot. And I thought, oh, well, they really do go. But we've just got to make them a little bit more Halloween-y. A little bit too big, actually. Um, I don't know if that could work. Yeah, I'm going to cut this one down. Just use the word poison. I'll just check the size of. Okay, sorry. I'm 
should do it in camera really. Check that size. Oh, I think that's okay. Yeah. And then over here, I'm going to put a little bit of a scrunchie there. Yeah. And I've got the number 31. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. It actually came to me after I put the video out. I'm like, how daft. Me saying, what's the number 31 got to do with it? <laughs> oh, <that's>, oh. <laughs> and we're back to front. <laughs> Whoops. That's the right way. <laughs> oh, well. It's now 13. <laughs> uh, sorry, Jonna. <laughs> Could have done with some little numbers there, really. Let's have a look. <laughs> Let's do it the right way here. Good start, isn't that? <laughs> Check. I'm just gonna put a little bit of glue under there. And this is the envelope that I used bleach out on it. It's amazing, isn't it? That that actually went pink through that yellow. That's better. Right. As you know, things like that do annoy me, so we shall be sticking a bit of that on there. <laughs> okay, right, let's have a look at some bits here. Oh, they're nice. See, sometimes when you go wrong, it does make you do things that you wouldn't normally do. So, right, there's a... Just want something small. Let's have a look at the stickers. Oh, bat. How about that little bat? Hoping I can get two out of that. Yeah, we just need something to offset it for colour. A bit of orange so it shows up. Oh, let's do it. A little bit of this. That's fine. Quite happy with that. Just need to put that like that. Oh, it's rugby, I think, <laughs> in the pub. <laughs> We're all in the pub watching it. <clears throat> yeah, I think it's Ireland playing to just England, I think. I remember rightly, husband said they won. <laughs> yes. 
wicked right um stamp i'll put that 31 just to make sure that's right way up this time Not really that scary, but hey ho. Right, I'm just gonna just make these a little bit blacker. made that um that was fading out a bit because again we bleached it and but i'm liking that now and that's looking more halloweeny yeah okay it's really funny because when i've done it because i was playing with the color combination and i'm like looking at it and i'm thinking gosh that looks really halloween <laughs> So that's worked well. So that's got to go in here somewhere. Oh, I want to do some more of those. I really, do you know, I really like those. And I'm so pleased with them because I'm actually, you know, that is actually my drawing. I've done it on the iPad last Christmas, I think. Because I was pra practicing with my new pen I got for Christmas last year. And I haven't really done much since. <laughs> done a couple of faces and that was it. And a skull. So I need to do some more, really. Right, let's have a look. Might not be in. Oh, no, that's a. I'm just wondering. Sorry, I'm looking at that now, thinking. Do you know what? That looks quite nice, though. Ah, yeah, doesn't fit. That's all right. Yes. Put that in. Not sure about that. That's okay. All right. Oh, and these pages, because they were really, really brittle and quite old, I've actually um, clear gessoed them. It's a tiny bit gritty, that clear gesso, but it's really protected the page, so I don't mind. Well, where are we going to put that? I know we could put it there, but it's lost, isn't it? Oh, unless we put it in here. Yeah, I quite like it over the page though. I'll just see first. Can I just put it over here? That looks quite nice, doesn't it? Yeah, and then we could have something, could have that at the top a little bit more because then we could have some pumpkins or something there because we've got pumpkins here. See if I can get two out of that. I think I can. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Let's put him there. So I'm not decorating them totally. I'd like to see Janet do a few bits to go in it as well. But hopefully she'll write in it. <laughs> put some of our scary faces in. Actually, I like it that way. Yep. Let's make sure there's no blue on that bit there. Nope. And 
sit there. Okay, and look at that envelope we've got to decorate here. I want him hanging somewhere, if you know what I mean, just sort of hanging out of the somewhere. <laughs> I told you I get more bits. <laughs> right, we've got to brighten this up with a bit of colour. Sort of, yeah, I want him there somewhere. I might actually staple him to there. I'm going to because I really like him. I'm hoping it'll go through. Okay, so I just like that there. Some no idea why. That's got to go there. Real stark white there. They're quite big, but I'm not. I've got this to do, this to put somewhere too. I'll take all those off. I think I'm going to start doing some tags to fit those pockets there. Not those the big ones. There's one here, isn't there? Thinking. That's going to go there. Let's, let's take some of the black. There's not much black on here, mind. All right. I'm it looking a bit dull. Yeah, that's better. Janet hand stamped all these things that I'm using, so it's ideal. It's, you know, it's her work. Won't make that too thick either. Yeah, it's another page I tore out and I just put that in there. Pockets and things need to do some tuck spots. What I'm gonna do, nope, I'm gonna start doing those. Because we need to get them done. Okay, so what I've done, I've gone ahead and cut file folders, okay, to fit in all the pockets that I want to do, that need bigger ones, and I've already done, and we shall get cracking. I'm going to make this, this one is definitely going to be tag, some are going to be journaling cards, some are tags, and I'm going to use some of the elements from the kits, um, different things, but this one I am going to cover with this because I love it uh, it's going to be you know quite a plainish tag but I want it to poke through the window so that's what I'm going to do with that one so that's the sort of thing again that I do you know I'm going to just do the edges there and I had uh, the file folders have been prepped with gesso, no tea stain, just gesso those. So I wouldn't use this, well I could use the tea stain one but I can do the back. I won't waste it on this because I'm going to cover it so. Okay, it's going to be quite simple really. I thought it would look nice poking through. I must probably stitch around it again. I can just see it, so I can just see the edge.
Okay, just gonna ink around the edges. Okay, and I'm gonna just glue mine, glue, stitch mine, and I'll be back. Okay, that's all done. I've gone ahead and put the grommet in, and the eyelet, and well, the eyelet, and the fibres there. Left some of the strings as well. It's just a bit of ripped lace that I've put on there. That's all. And I'm going to use this ledger stamp. Um, I know you're going to ask me where I got this. Um, I think it did come in a package, okay, but I can't find it anywhere. But I have a feeling it's Hero Arts, okay. But I know it's you know a good one if you know what I mean. in the front if I can find the journal <laughs> oh I got it <clears throat> I'm looking for black and orange and of course it's wrapped up in this right for protection until I've done it okay so you know yeah simple tag but nice bit of paper there that could be wrapping paper or anything like that so and that goes in there quite nicely yeah okay I'm making that oh my gosh I love him <laughs> now he looks like he's really scared doesn't he he looks happy most of mine look very happy <laughs> but that one's good <laughs> okay so I can take that off of there Okay, and on to the next one. Right, what I'm going to do, the ones I actually keep quite plain, I'll just go ahead and, yeah, that one's got to be plain because it's got to go in, in there. And there's quite a lot going on on that page. So I'm going to, could have done another leaf actually, thinking about it. No, no I think because I tore one of the pages out of here. That's why it looks different. Yeah, and I've got two leaves here where I could, I might have another. I'm not sure. We'll see. But I'm going to go ahead and just cover that one with something. And any of the others that I just cover, I will go ahead and do because that's you see me do one and it's, I do exactly the same for all the others. But the ones I decorate, I'll come back to you on. Okay. Okay. I said I would pop back if I was going to do anything different and with this it lends itself to having a bit of glitter. I've just covered this one with some, it could be scrap baking, um, scrapbooking paper for you. I'm using just stuff I've printed because I haven't got any Halloween scrapbooking paper. Not handy anyway. Most probably in my loft and I've got some. Um, I've got this two-way glue pen that's very fine. I used to use these on my card making things that I used to do and I am just literally drawing around this okay and I'm gonna add some glitter so I'll go ahead and do that and then oops went off a bit there but never mind oh and I just slightly inked it up as well because this was white just with a bit of purple there I must probably miss some but so I'll go ahead and do that and I'll come back when it's ready to glitter. It doesn't dry, it stays sticky until you put the glitter on, so. Okay, that's finished. Um, I don't know whether you hear in the background, there might be some singing and all that one quiet moments. It's just that we've got a shanty festival going on, which I shall be going out later to listen to the first one, listen to it rather, first one we've ever had actually, so. It should be quite good. There's um, a big stage on the quay and different things going on. But I'm not going out to, till later because I find that it's all a bit much really. If I go out too long. Oh, I should have put paper down. Never mind, I'll brush it off in a minute. Okay. It's 
my little brush. Oh, I've got one of these. Oh, I use glamour dust, it's called. Okay. And that just just adds a little bit. I didn't want too much because um, you know, like I say, it's you no know, not sparkly, but I think a little bit of um sort of glamour dust is you know, I'm just gonna what's it is good for this sort of thing because it reminds me, you know, in the, the dew on the cobwebs glistens doesn't it in the sun so that's that one and that is going to go in here uh, oh i might have a charm on this one yes i got some charms thank you very much vicky for that oh that looks nice in there and that just moves that over a bit okay that's good yeah that's nice i'm gonna oh i didn't do that did i what i'm gonna do in that one i think another stamp uniquely handmade let's do that one <laughs> it's not really <laughs> some of my other ones are but <laughs> i'll just do that here early in the morning they're singing hooray oh, no, i can't sing uh, <laughs> I'm not at all. I'm really bad. I'm, I think I'm tone deaf, actually. And I, don't, and I don't even think I can sing. I'm definitely not one of those. I can't. <laughs> I can dance, but I can't sing. And I'm just going to lightly press that, like that. Okay. Just to give a sort of indication lines sometimes is enough for us to write on okay all right need to just dry that off a bit okay, that's fine. charm yes i made some last night i hope i'm too far away and the charms vicky sent me so hey look at those <laughs> Thank you very much, Vicky. They're amazing. So, I've done a load yesterday. It's great. So, I've got to use one of them. So I'm going to use a spider. Well, that's going to be quite nice. And I put them all on these. I don't use them all on paper clips. On paper clips, though. I do take them off. But I quite like to store that. wondering whether we can put it on I don't think so is there a way is there a way I haven't tried so I don't know Isn't that done there they just run the wrong way like that just wondered if that will go yes it will All right okay we got it so I'm going to put that like that Okay, and then I'm going to wrap something in there. Maybe a bit of orange ribbon. I've got some of this here. Yes, I thought I'd just do a bit to my journal and then I might even have some more fluffy stuff when I can find it. Yeah, I like that. And let's put that in. So I think there's um, a lot of laughter. <laughs> and then that can over there like this I think that was okay put that on that okay just thinking 
do I need something at the back there? Yep, I do. I need a bit of purple at the back here. Yeah, I've got some like um, fluffy yarn, which I'll add some of that as well. I love that. I haven't got it handy at the moment. Yeah, we've got a big choir here, actually, in Mavigacy. Male, um, Mavigacy Male Voice Choir. I think there's about 60 members. It's massive. And I'm definitely going to go through and add a little of green, okay, in some of these pages. Because I really haven't got a lot of green and I want to add it. So I will be doing that at some point. I'll just hope that lays down nicely. Yeah. I'll just see next to it. It's fine. I tend to like charms over the page more, really. But I couldn't resist one of them spiders. Right. And what is going to be on this one then? Yeah, that's another going to be another flat one here because of the sort of pocket it is. Um, definitely got to put some it here as well. So I'm going to leave that there. What have we got here? All right, the spider. It's, it's going to be, yeah, I think black spiders and then a decoration. So I'm going to use, I think I'm going to use that to cover this one. So that's just normal. Okay, so I'll be back in a minute. I thought I'd play the video because they're right outside near enough. On the tag. <laughs> oh, <there is. laughs> I think they're practicing. <laughs> They were practicing outside the pub. <laughs> right, we can continue now. <laughs> I just thought it was really nice, so I thought I'd like, you know, for you to hear it. I'm going to be green too. So I'm just thinking, tug spot. <laughs> I could stick it to a bit of card. Yep, yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I am. Stick it to a bit of card to, to add a little bit of, you know, robustness. Bit of fun, isn't it? And I've got a bit of green, you see, because I'm trying to introduce a bit more green because I've, I've gone off and I haven't, I haven't done it, which I was going to, and so we've got to do it after now. There you go, I stitched all around that. Oh, it looks quite nice, and that what you think? That's only cake, you know, cupcake thingy. So no nicking your kids' cupcakes <laughs> just to have these. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm 
going to put that there. And we're going to have something coming out the side as well. So I'm going to glue that just on the edge. Just come over the stitching as well a little bit. See what we got here. I keep going to this. <laughs> oh dear, I'm forever using that. It's a sort of I quite fancy that, like that. It's getting a bit noisy out there now. <laughs> I think the alcohol is working on some. <laughs> there you go. All right, let's see. I've got a ghost actually. <laughs> One of Janet's. <laughs> okay. I'm going to leave him there. He's cute. Need some googly eyes. I haven't got any actually. I suppose she got some. She only got a funny nose. <laughs> some googly eyes on there. Definitely. He's staying there. He's cute. Oh, he might get stuck actually. I'll just pin him there for now. Do that for now until it's dry. Yeah, and that goes over the edge there. So again, that looks nice. And that, they're too big to go inside those ones. So. Okay, on with the next one. I love that. It's really nice. Don't know where she got that from. Eat drink and be scary. I might actually. I'm just wondering if we can make um like a tag like that. I really wanted to track away from him. No, not going to. I'm going to do something like that. Yeah. Okay, well, bit of spray, I think. Dry that off. All right, I'll tell you what we could do with, I'm just thinking, a bit of gold embossing powder, but I've no idea where it is. Gosh, I'd have to look for it. <laughs> Sort of spider webs all on the outside, and then gold embossing powder would look fabulous, wouldn't it? Right, a little bit of black soot on here. You know what I will do? Put some gilding wax around the outside. Um, yeah, a bit of orange. that 
very popular this one this journal <laughs> Let's get some gold gilding wax go around the outside there I use the I think it's Pebio Pebio one so I've had that long time that one gotcha. I reckon 10 15 Okay, I'm going to stitch around that and also put a tab on the top of some kind. Um, we need to cover that a little bit, don't we? There's definitely some nice music going on. music singing Okay, I'm going to stitch around that. Okay, stitched all around that. Now that's looking good. That's just a very simple tag. Alright, and there's the back. And that goes in there. And then I've introduced a little bit of purple because I wanted to do that. Yeah, I'm liking that. Because I'm trying to get sort of purple and you know, still got to do me green. But that one's done. So, what's next is this big one here. So, that again is going to be just a. Oh, that's the last one. Gosh. Okay, that one. Let's put that. Try and get some. I'm going to do pumpkins again with that one because I quite like those pumpkins and they're nice and bright. Um, sideways, yeah, we can do that. Okay, another simple one. So again, I'll go ahead and do that one and sew round it and then that is it. Here we go, that one's in there and I'm going to introduce a bit of green. I'm using Twisted Citron. I really like this colour for Halloween and I thought I would add a bit around here just 
just uh, it's a little bit lighter there maybe a bit under there so I've got green in here you see so, and oh, I have a bit here because that's a bit of a lighter area and a little bit under here a little bit lighter okay that's that and need some string here and then I thought if we had a bit of string here we could actually hang something from it so I've got a bit of embroidery silk that will work I think so again not too bulky So I'm knotting it so it's not so it's quite tight. There you go. And then tie a little bow. And just yeah, so we can have something hanging there. Okay, but I haven't got anything thin enough, anything thin enough at the moment. I might make that into a little tuck spot on there. But change because I might forget by tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, right, well thank you very much then. That's the next little, um, ser not series, but part, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.